Welcome back to Fishing Dorset Live. Fishing locally today, south coast, doing a rub reviews this morning. I filmed quite a bit on the rub reviews. I thought I'd share the rest of the few hours this morning with you lot. Welcome in. I've got a squid and rag only today. Both rods are out. I've already had one fish. You will not believe the video, guys, on the first cast as I was doing an intro. But welcome in. Wait for the video Wednesday, guys. Welcome to a glorious morning in Dorset. It's absolutely stunning. Kojak, welcome in, buddy. Just quickly setting up my um, tripod so I can read the chat back. But what a morning, it's absolutely cracking morning. So I'm just trying to get the phone set square, should get a square picture. Turn my second phone down. Let's get the live chat up. Randall, welcome in buddy, I'm getting ready for bed. I was up at four o'clock this morning, Randall. <coughs> I've already recorded quite a bit of a video on the reviews of the two new rods I've got out in front of me. But I appreciate you coming in, Randall, mate. You have a good sleep. <clears throat> Almost 11 there. It's 10 to 7 here, Randall, in the morning. But welcome in. I'm just going to bring that right rod in. It's been out there for a while and I've had a few bites on it. So we could have a, we could possibly have a fish on this one. I am recording the rest of my video as well. So you'll have to bear with me because I am recording.
just back out of the west bay ring. I'll get that quick on. So I've got a ragged squid on here. Tip of squid. But I'm on the new competition surf from Black Rock. She's a beauty. Everybody, welcome in Pat. Is the microphone not working? Can you hear? Oh, can you hear me? Oh, it is. The microphone's working. But yeah, basically all I've done this morning is just come down and test these two brand new rods out. Got the new twin tip renaissance on the left and I've got the new competition surf on the right. I'll take it the picture and the sound's good, guys. Wouldn't you welcome it, buddy? <coughs> right, I need it. <coughs> I need a coffee. I'll just quickly get this one baited up. I'm ready to go back out. And then I'm going to sit and have a break. Welcome in, Paul. Nice fresh braggy on here. The size of them. Look at the size of that. It's huge.
Right, now I'm going to have a coffee. Right, it'll be messed. Ah, uh, right, okay. You couldn't hear me when I was reading the rod in. Diane, welcome in, Diane. Diane, I don't use the mics on the live stream. I only use them on my, um, when I'm recording. I was recording when I was bringing that rod in. Obviously, I have been filming from about five o'clock this morning, so. Can I sit? Welcome to the live. Have a nice coffee. First one of the morning. Yeah, Diane, I haven't been live long at all. Um, Kayak Paul messaged me, said he stopped this live, go live if I want to. Um, I've recorded what I wanted to this morning, which is good. So I thought I'd pop a live for a few hours this morning. Obviously, Caroline's got my grandson. We've had my grandson all night, so... Caroline's probably watching, but she mightn't come in the chat, but she, she'll probably be there. But welcome in, everybody. It's an early start, <laughs> but there's 20 in the chat and only 13 likes, so smash them likes, guys. Yeah, I'm only here to about upper 10, Diane. Um, I've got to park in till 11 o'clock, so if I pack up at half 10, it just gives me enough time to get back to the van. Yeah, Paul was live this morning. I got up at half four, him and JD were live. But I'm not getting notifications for Paul at all. And I don't know why. But yeah, when you watch a video, guys, it'll probably be out two weeks time because I've got the boat video to come out this week and today's video I'll probably pop it out next week I started doing an intro and the rod took off as I was doing an intro when I first started so it's a bit of an epic start to the next video <laughs> anything else comes out as a bonus today so Yeah they, yeah, they had a few rays out, Diane and that. Yeah, they've done really well. But it's a beautiful morning, absolute beautiful morning. Oh, Diane, I think they were live all night. <laughs> But yeah, all I've come out is just to review those rods, which I've done. I've got those brand new rods on Thursday, so. Hey, cheers, Alan Bird, and welcome in, buddy. I doubt if we'll get many on this morning, it's too early. <laughs> But it is an absolute beautiful morning. Yeah, Diane, me and Caroline went straight to bed last night after we spoke to you. Being on that, on that boat all day Friday, Saturday, I was absolutely knackered. But the rods I've got this morning is I've got the brand new Renaissance Twin Tip, the 2024 model, and I've got the Competition Surf, which is 1410, uh, 2024 model. So Renaissance on the left, Competition Surf on the right. That's the 2024 brand new models out, guys. Twelve thousand steps.
Yeah, the bird squawk. I hope, you, I hope you can hear the the waves, guys. The waves are really nice in the morning. Yeah, Paul done all right. He, did, he had a good sesh. I've pulled one fish out, but not on the live. So hopefully we could get some out. I just thought I'd share the rest of the morning. Hey, Danny. Yeah, no worries, Dan. Tight lines, chat. Morning, Lee Hopkins. Welcome in, buddy. But yeah, you and Tim have a good day, Dan. Send us a message, mate, if you back up. But what a beautiful morning. Right, I'm gonna bring that left rod in. That's been out there for a little bit now. I go one left, one right. I've checked the time. Just bear with me, guys. I want to make sure of the tide. I might put one out left, one out right. I'll just check the tide. We are coming off of springs as well. Pull tide times. Right, the tide's falling and I'll have to go right and to the left. Right, there we go. That's all fresh baits out there. Let's put the live chat back up on the other phone. Right, I'm going to bake that, that rig back up.
we must have spider crabs. One of the hooks is going to cut off. Those spider crabs. Right, I'll have to get another hook on there. The old spider crabs. Right, that's a new hook on. Put a squid on it. Cut me a fresh bit of squid out. Prop it up so it's quick. Right, that's it. That's a load more squid prepped up. Mark Hanley, welcome in, buddy. Marcus, welcome in. Carl Dawson, welcome in. Lawrence, welcome in. Yeah, I'm all good. Cheers, Carl, buddy. But yeah, basically what I've done this morning, I was fishing by about five o'clock this morning. Um, I basically come down to review the new, on the right-hand side, yellow, the twin tip renaissance and on the left hand side I've got the new competition surf so I've come down to do a review which I've done so I thought I'd just share the rest of the, the morning with you obviously I am still recording if there's any footage but yeah welcome in everybody Obviously, JD and Paul won't be in there packing up now. They finished their session. And they had a really good session as well. So if you're bored this afternoon, go and check out Kayak Dangler's um, live stream from last night and this morning. They were live this morning when I got up at four o'clock.
I was at yesterday morning on the Humber. One flounder. Nice one, Cole. I'll give you a, I'll give you a funny one, Cole. I've got a video to edit from today, mate. I set both rods up, cast them out. I, re I started doing my intro. Within about four seconds of doing my intro, my rod took off. <laughs> I ain't gonna tell you what it is. Because what went on before the live doesn't go on the live. <laughs> hey, JD, how you doing, chat? i tell you what, Lawrence, mate, it's beautiful down here this morning. Absolutely beautiful. Hi, hi, Paul. Cheers for the shout out, Paul, after your live, buddy. Appreciate that chat, like always. That's what it's about, shouting out your mate's channels. And I really do appreciate that. Yeah, that's what I did, Paul. I was watching your live while I was driving. I watched you get that big ray and all. But what I'm going to have to do later on, Paul, I'm going to have to unsubscribe from your channel and subscribe again because I'm not getting notifications for your channel. Peter Andrews, welcome in, buddy. So, yeah, what I'll do is I'll unsubscribe and then subscribe again. And hopefully I'll get the notifications, Paul. Hopefully Dan will go live later. We'll have lives all day. <laughs> I've got to cut the grass this afternoon. That'll be nice and dry. But yeah, we're coming off the springs now, so we haven't got a lot of movement. Well, like I say, any fish this morning is a bonus, and I've had one, but it'd be nice to get one of the live. It certainly was, Peter. But I've got, I've got all three rods with me today. So I've got the Renaissance 2024. I've got the Competition Surf 2024. And I've got the Fusa 2024. But the Fusa's in the, in the rod bag because I, I left the other tripod at home. Because uh, I had to take my son's bike for an MOT yesterday. So we emptied the van out. And I left the blooming tripod at home. So I can't put three out this morning. Oh, now I've lost one of my leads. Where's my leads gone? I keep losing charge leads. Where the hell's that gone? Aha, got it.
Come on, fish, where are you? Forty people in the live, twenty-six likes. Smash that like, guys, if you're not subscribed. Think about subscribe, but it's totally free, and it does help my channel. But yeah, it's quite nice being privileged to try these ones out. It really is. I don't think I, I don't think I missed anybody. Lee Hopkins, I don't think. I, morning, Lee Hopkins. Sorry, buddy. I can't remember if I said hello or not. But yeah, it's really weird this time in the morning, one penis, thumbs down on the live stream. I really appreciate your view chat, thanks very much. <laughs> Absolute brilliant, I love it. I'll tell you what Diane, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Nah, Diane, it don't matter. It's still a view. What they've got to realise is, when they tick it, it's still a view. So, thank you very much. I really appreciate it this morning. <laughs> Any view is a good view. That's the outlook on life. <laughs> I'm out live fishing. You're sat at home doing that. Cheers for the view. Hey, Randolph, how you doing, buddy? Yeah, it's going good, Randolph. Um, for those people that have just come in, I've been filming since five o'clock this morning, doing a rub review. Um, I've got enough footage from that, so I thought I'd pop a live up and then just basically record anything else that, I, that happens on the live. But yeah, welcome in Randolph, good to see you fella. Yeah, I think they're both going out, Diane. I think they're both heading out now for turbo. Hey, Link, how you doing, fella? Morning, Shay, morning, all. Oh, just got a quick high pull, but stand it. Yeah, it's Link. I'm only out for a few hours, chap. Just doing a rub review. Um, right hand side, Link. I've got the 2024 twin tip Fusa. I've got the big carbon tip in that one. And on the left hand side, I've got the new 2024 competition surf. And I'll tell you what, mate, you wait for the video. I literally put both rods out. 
I started doing an intro within about three seconds of starting that intro, mate. The blood took off. Colin Ross, welcome in, Cole. Good to see you, fella. Uh, Mark, I've only got rag and squid, mate. That's all I brought down today. I'm only out for a few hours. But yeah, hope you're all good, Link. Hope your job's going all right as well, fella. But yeah, Colin Ross is a friend of mine, guys, local fella. Um, helped me out with a seagull last week. <laughs> but yeah, Colin's a um, pretty keen sea angler as well. But yeah, rig-wise, I've got two free hook flappers and I've got a wishbone. But like I say, I literally come out just to do a rub review. And there's people going swimming. There's been people swimming all morning. Love my concerts. What was, I can't say Link, because it'd be on a video, mate. What happens before the live doesn't come on the live. <laughs> Otherwise, people won't watch the video. Jamie Murray, welcome in, Jamie. Cheers for that, Jake. Just hopefully we can get some out within a couple of hours. It'd be nice to get a fat, I'm out for a big place. I want a two pound plus place out, but fishing's been quite quiet on the beach lately down this way. But I sat behind the phone, enjoying the view, watching the rods, chatting away. But if you could share me out, guys, I'd really appreciate it on your social medias, on your Facebooks, Instagram, on your TikToks on whatever else you got. I really appreciate it. I, I haven't shared anything this morning. Yeah, I'll see you, Jamie, up all night. <laughs> Absolute diamond you are, Jamie. But what I might also possibly do, actually, I might put a single pulley rig out there, actually, and just load it up, because I'm not taking no bait home today. Let me see what's in my fishing box of goodness. Yeah, I'm going to get, I think I'll go for a single. If I can get it out. Right, I'm just going to bait, um, So I can get a lot more distance with a single hook. Just untangle it. Yeah, Lawrence was star, mate. Thanks very much. And thanks everybody else that shared the live this morning. I, I just didn't bother. I didn't share it at all. I just went live. Well, that's a bit of a crap rig. How does that work then? This ain't Aaron's rig, by the way. This is somebody else. Somebody else gave me a rig. And it's supposed to be a clip down. 
How the hell has that been made? Right, that rig's coming off. What a total load of crap. I don't know if you can see this, guys, but look. How the hell is that? Am I supposed to clip that? The actual body's too small. Somebody's not thought about how to make rigs. Absolutely pointless rig. I thought I'd try it as well, but that's a good start, isn't it? Lucky I didn't say whose rig it is, but I thought I'd try it. That's about as useful as a chocolate teapot. Hey, Craig, welcome in, chat. Right, let's pull another one out of the packet and see if it's exactly the same. Brendan, welcome in, chat. How can I shout people's rigs out if they can't make a rig? Right, let's get the second one out and see if that works. Absolutely not. How the hell is that supposed to work? Look at the size difference to where the clip is. Right, that's one lot of rigs I won't be shouting out. How the hell are you supposed to use them? Yeah, I, I got given a few rigs, Craig, by a local bloke. And I certainly like to know how you use these rigs. Because the um the hook snood is too long, it won't even clip. Hey Mr. Merritt's in the chat. Big shout out, Paul Merritt guys. You absolutely legend, Paul. Right, he can have those rigs back. I won't say who they are. But they are absolutely dog crap. So that's the second one out of the pocket, and it's too long. But welcome in, Paul. Many thanks for that donation, chap. I'm just trying to sort of... Right, on a go. Absolute dog crap rigs. Fell asleep, yeah. Good morning, Paul. I certainly like to know how he explains those rigs, how they work. Because they don't work. Absolute If people send you stuff, make sure it works. But I'm not cruel enough to say whose rigs they are. But they don't work.
Right. I'll show you one that does work. Yeah, there we go. I read that actually works. Alex Birkins, tight lines, people have to get some bait. Yeah, tight lines as well then, Alex. Just when I go back for the chat. Do you need a decent wig, mate? Yes. <laughs> Obviously, Aaron's hand tied does supply me a few wigs, but yeah, somebody else locally made some. I think to get a shout out, but there ain't no way I'm shouting them wigs out. If they worked, I might off. They won't even clip down. The hooks, dude's too long. And if it was an up and over, there ain't nothing to clip it into. But yeah, have a good day, Alex, mate. But yeah, well done, Jay and Paul, mate. Absolutely brilliant live. But yeah, I think it's going to be quiet. Obviously, it switched off on the boat Friday afternoon. It totally switched off fishing. Right, let me just check what time I can put. Obviously, I'm at sandbanks again, so I've just got to be careful. Yeah, I've got to be packed up by half ten and back to the van for eleven. So we've got a good couple of hours live. Just hopefully we can pull some out. Yeah, I've just had two, Diane. <laughs> right, let's get that competition in.
Well, I'm going to whack this one over to the right. Right, that's a pulley rig out on the right. I've lobbed one out to the right. I'll see what the tide does to it. MJ, welcome in, buddy. Simon Buster, welcome in, buddy. Just got to bait up this other rig I just brought in. What I'm going for. I've got a wishbone on there. So I've got rag, tip of squid on both. Just got to keep an eye on that right rod if that tide pulls it around by that green post, otherwise I've got to rip it in, otherwise I'll lose all my gear. Uh, Paul Merritt, I have, mate, I had a fish before the live. Um, I'll say it again because you obviously went in the chat. Yeah, what I started to do is I put both rods out, started to do an intro, within about three, four seconds of that intro, I got hit by a fish. You have a nice day. Cheers, NJ. Bye.
but I've got five and six ounce grip leads on. It's not, it's not a big tide. I'm right to the left, but to the right, I might have to bring that rod in if it carries on going. It is bit in, but I think the tide's pushing it. But obviously, this Wednesday's video will be the boat video. And it's a bit of a gutter, because I lost a lot of footage and I don't know why. Um, cut the clips I lost sound on, don't know why. But I still got a good edit from it. Somebody else fishing further down on the next coins. Welcome in, Ollie. And then we've got people just about to go swimming to my left. So if they swim out, they're going to get in my line. Hey, Mr. Beast, how you doing, fella? Yeah, no worries, chap. I've got a line out that way. Excuse me. Excuse me. Absolute retards. You do get them down the south coast really. You can, the people can see you fishing and they go right upside your lines, swimming. So we could have a swimmer on, we could get a new PB. Stop going in the water, they're in the water, mate. There's three of them. <laughs> They've been doing it since about five o'clock this morning. People have been in and out. Yeah, it's three women, Diane. <laughs> Got more balls than me. I don't think I'd have any. Oh, well, I don't think I'd have any if I jumped in that water. Jesus Christ! I bet it's freezing. There you go. Look. Hold on. Let me just look at them. Nutters. Absolute nutters. Yeah, it's supposed to, it's supposed to burn. 
burn calories and good for the heart in that. A nice little fishing boat going out. Yeah, it's supposed to be good for you. I'd rather stay on dry land myself. Just cut down on the chocolate. Richie D, welcome in fella. Hi bud. Happening all the time in the silent peak. Yeah, that's it. I'll get a new PB swimmer. But yeah, welcome to my live guys. Appreciate you all coming in this morning. I know it's early. But there ain't no better way of sharing fishing. Obviously I am videoing and I'm live. Oh, that sun's coming through the clouds. Oh. And I left my sunglasses in my other fisher box for the boat. And I get blinded. But we're on a poor tide, so if any fish come out on the live, it's a bonus. Come on the place, that's what we want. We want a nice big two pound plus place. Hey, Sean, how you doing, bud? I see you had a good session, buddy. But I've got a nice suntan out on the boat. Love it when Shane fishing. Yeah, it'd be nice if there's a fish to put on the live. <laughs> I had a fish before the live. Yeah, it's, it's beautiful, Sean. I've been down here since five o'clock. I, I, like I say, for people that have just come in, I've come out this morning just to film the new rods. Um, Sean, on the left is the new twin tip food, uh, renaissance, and on the right is a competition surf. Um, I've basically come down just to review them this morning. Um, I literally put both rods out, set the camera up. Within about four seconds of starting to film, the new Renaissance, uh, was it the Renaissance? I can't remember now. I think it was the Renaissance took off. It went absolutely spastic. <laughs> yeah, cheers, Paul.
and I got the whole footage as well. I was literally just started to talk. I looked round at the rods just to talk about them and then the rod took off, literally took off. Ah, oh, sure, mate. It's impressive. It's really impressive. If we get a session out, Sean, have a go on it, mate. It is somewhere else. Um, but in the butt of the rod is a screw-on cap and you can alter the weight so you can balance the rod out. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, big shout-out, Diane Andrews. Diane, you're an absolute legend. Big thanks for that, Diane. Let's have some fireworks in the chat, guys, for Diane and Mr. Merritt. Absolute legends. But like I said, I did want to go southbourne, but this week, Wednesday, um, I'm filming for Bournemouth University, and on the Sunday, I'll be filming the beach session for Bournemouth University this week. Yeah, you're an absolute star, Diane. I prob I'll probably get the second fuser next, but Andy is trying to sort me out with a boat rod for the tail. Ah, right, all right, Sean. I got the fuser in today, but it's in the bag. I, I left me other tripod at home. Otherwise, I could have had all three out. Right, I'm going to bring that fuser in there. That's been out there a little bit. A uh, fuser renaissance. Got fuser on the brain. Right, you just have to bear with me for now. I've just got a film. This one's going out. Tell anyone I've got a film going out. So just bear with me for two minutes. Thank you. 
Right, there we go. That was a new renaissance getting lobbed out. Brian Duck Field, welcome in, buddy. Yeah, it's a nice one, mate. It is a beautiful one. Right, I just got to quickly make sure I got the footage of that rock getting cast out. I'll be two seconds out of the chat. Obviously, I can check the footage through back on my phone instead of going through the GoPro, which is good. I'll just be out of chat for a couple of minutes, they ain't picking me GoPro up for some reason. Don't know why. I'll be two minutes, guys. I'll just quickly change the battery on the GoPro. But these new GoPro batteries are lasting a lot better. Definitely worth spending that money. So big thanks for the super chats, guys, because that's what paid for the batteries for the GoPro. I've got three new batteries. GoPro, turn off. Right, that's a nice new battery in it. But yeah, just a massive thanks for everybody um, that watches the videos, watches the live streams, that donates to the channel. Every single one of you helped to get the money to buy stuff for the channel. And it's massively appreciated, absolutely hugely appreciated. Obviously, I've spent quite a bit of personal money doing my own channel. 
So I'm just getting my chat back up, guys, and I'll, I'll come back in. Two seconds. But yeah, every single penny goes back to buying stuff for the channel. Oh, let me turn my volume down. Oh, Mr. Beast Camping, welcome in, buddy, and a big shout out for that donation chat. Massively appreciated. Let's have some fireworks in the chat, guys, from Mr. Bees. And uh, welcome in, buddy. I think I said morning, but morning, Brian. Welcome in. But yeah, I'm not leaving those baits out there too long today. I've got no plans taking bait home. If I've got any bait left, I'll go down to the ferry and I'll expect one of my mates to be fishing there and they can have whatever bait I've got left. Beaches are starting to fill up a little bit now. But yeah, welcome in Mr. B and a big thank you for that donation. Absolute legends. And the, the live stream on the boat, I know it weren't like too many fish, but me and Malcolm absolutely smashed the morning session out and it just switched off in the afternoon. And it's my biggest hitting live stream. I'm well over 3K views on that. So big thanks for everybody that joined and watched it back. 
And what I didn't do, I didn't monetize that live at all until, it, until I finished. Yeah, hold on, I'm just trying to, I lost my chat, where's my chat gone? Yeah, cheers Diane, yeah, I'm so chuffed for that live stream. You can watch it back Diane. <laughs> But yeah, I'll tell you the view, hold on, I'll tell you the exact views I got on that live stream from Friday. I'll tell you the exact figure. 3,302 views on that live stream from Friday. Absolutely made up, really made up. I've got both rods out to the left now. Right, I'm just gonna bake that pulley pulley rig up. And we got four more swimmers, so we'll see what happens. Let's see if I got a shout. Oh yeah, yeah, my son. We could have done it today, but my son's um got stuff on. But yeah, the boat will be out soon with this weather. I can see a few boats out where me and Malcolm started off yesterday, so. Malcolm had a real good morning session out yesterday with, um, I think it's about 10 customers or 8 customers on his boat. So yeah, Malcolm had a good trip, which is good. Hey, hey talk about the devil. Welcome in, Milk. Cool, coincidence. But yeah, big fireworks in the chat, guys, for tech Malcolm taking me out Friday. Absolute legend. Can't wait to get the boat out again. Couple of weeks, probably. Yeah, we'll probably be a couple of weeks short. We're no rush, really, to be fair. I prefer shore fishing, but it is nice to get the boat out. All right, let me just check this tide because I can see hook sands ripping up. Yes, we're nearly at the bottom of low water, then we've got to run in. So hopefully it'd be nice to get one fish on the live. <laughs>
but like I say, Wednesday's video is Malcolm's boat. So, hope you enjoy that for Wednesday. I've already ed edited it. It's up on YouTube in private. Blimey, the swimmers actually asked where my lines were. Ah, uh, right, all right, Milk. Yeah, there's a few boats out in the patch already. Funny, Shane, I had most of my fish in like the past year. I'll tell you what, Sean. When I could get ragworm, mate, and I could only get lockworm, I absolutely smashed the fish in. So you're not wrong there, mate. That's not wrong at all. I have been finding lug has been producing, but obviously I've got the ragworm left on the boat, so I'm not going to waste it. I'm going to use it. And like I said, I come out to review those rods this morning. This live is a pure bonus. I could have just sat here, chilled out. And as a paddle border, absolutely bell. But yeah, lugworm has been producing for me a lot more than what ragworm has lately. And that's a fact. Your mate Jay Hemming will pass you. Ah, uh, right, yeah, I won't be here that long, Milk. I'm only here to half ten, mate. I've got the car parked to eleven. So I'll pack up at half ten and get back to the car. Right, let's have another brew. Jonathan Britt, welcome in, buddy. Good luck, Shane. We'll be fishing Kent Coast, probably Ramsgate Friday. Good size back. Yeah, tight lines then, um, Jonathan. And welcome in, buddy. Thought you were out the... Nah, not today, Milk. My son's busy this morning. He's got a few things to do. But I ran the old centre engine up uh, in the week and I ran the main motor up in the week as well, so everything's charged up, ready to head out. It's dead flat out here, Milk. Dead flat. Don't know where the fish are. Like I say, if you are in the background, guys, smash that like, hit a subscribe. It's all free and it does help my channel. And I'd really appreciate it. That's 32 premium. Yeah, that's good going, Mel. We done pretty well there, didn't we? <laughs> Where's the fish? If only live, just a little bit closer to the ocean, not that I'm too far. Maybe I'll start to do saltwater fishing more spring and summertime. Yeah, give it a go, NJ. Give it a bash. Welcome in, Holy. Yeah, cheers for that. It's a very quiet morning for the live, but it went before the live.
would be nice to get one fish out for their life. But we're just coming off the springs as well, which sometimes ain't good. But I've done, I've normally done pretty well on neat sides, to be honest. Right, I'm just going to record a bit of footage, guys. Right, that's that like little bit of footage filmed. Oh my gosh, I just had a PayPal. I just got to log into my PayPal. I don't know why it keeps signing me out and then I have to... wait for a code. Just bear with me for a minute.
Right, big shout out in the chat, guys, from Fireworks. Peter Rodron sent me a PayPal. Peter, you absolute legend, mate, and I do appreciate that, chap. I, I don't know whether I miss you in the chat or you're just sat there chilling out, and a lot of people do do that. But massive thank you, Peter. Oh, Diane, shut up. Oh, bacon and egg bat this morning. Oh. Come on, guys, get the fireworks on the chat. Peter Rolden on the PayPal. Absolute legends. But yeah, this is a very quiet life. Not even had a bite. This is what happened yesterday. It just switched off. But that tide. Oh, bacon for me. Let me just go back on the tide. Low water at 8.52. So we've got a little bit and then we'll fish a running and hopefully it'll pick up. But what I'll have to do is I'll be casting both rods to the right when that tide comes back in. Not to the left. Shut up, Malcolm. <laughs> Shall I tell you what I have got, though? But somebody nicked one out of my fridge, and I'm gutted. Devastated. My breakfast, which I'm just about to eat now, Scotched egg. That's my brekkies and I'm just about to eat it. But somebody nicked one. I had two. And somebody nicked one out of the fridge. Naming no names, Kieran James. Oh. Look at that. Let's see if it brings a fish on. <laughs> oh yeah, runny egg. It's got to be runny egg. Thing is, I, I like egg on, egg on toast. I absolutely love egg on toast. But it's got to be a runny egg. Where's the fish? What well, start to the day, Scotch egg. <laughs> Shane, send photo, buddy. What? Send a photo of what? Oh, this Scotch egg's beautiful. I knew you were going to look, Amy. I got a Scotch egg <coughs> and bourbon biscuits for breakfast. Beautiful. Breakfast of champions. What did you send it on, Amy? Yeah, I think that's Pescari just come out now, Milk. I think. Go that towards Old Harry. 
I don't know what the messages come from. It's not on Facebook. Yeah, I can't see your message, Aid. What did you send it through? I can't do runny egg. Yeah, I've got a runny egg. I can't stand hard eggs, Paul. Are you supposed to spread it over your sandwich? Right, two hours. We've got to get a fish for this live, guys. Oh, that boat was better than some black diesel app, jeez. Yeah, that's where he's going, Mel. He's heading out towards old Harry. Looks like he's doing about 20 knots. He ain't hanging about. Guy and Debs, welcome in. Morning, Shane. Hope you do well this morning. We've uh, lug, rag, lug, last time I've seen some better than the flounder. Yeah, I have been using a lot of lug worm lately, and I must admit, I am getting better results, so I might just go back to lug for the beach. I am getting a lot more success, but on the place, I've been getting success on the rag worm, so. But all I've got this morning is rag from the boat and squid. So I'm just going to use that up. Yeah, hopefully it'll start picking up for your milk. I really do hope it picks up for your chap. You deserve it. I just can't believe how quiet it's been. That early live from what I say, 107 minutes, an early two hour live, and we've not even had a bite. It's all very quiet. In the summer, Shane, we will get an Uber early to go bass. Oh, mate, I'd love that. I would love that. I just hope that video comes out Wednesdays. A good video for everybody to watch back. I spent about three hours edit editing it. <laughs> So, 
<laughs> nah, that's my rub bags. That's all my rub bags. I'm sat behind the camera, watching the camera and watching my rods. But what I might do, um, well, I've got that pulley rigged up. What I might do is I might just put all squid on the pulley. Obviously, I'm using rag tip with squid on the free hook flappers. Why can't you tell when a pterodactyl is in the toilet, the PSI, I'll get my coat? Huh? Have I missed something? Why, why can't you tell when a pterodactyl is in the toilet? Ah, it's all right. I switched on then. <laughs> Tom, welcome in. This is very quiet, really quiet. Another couple of angus turn up on the next green down. But yeah, welcome in Tom. Brilliant to see new people in the live. I just want to sort that out. I just want to get
Good, mate. Yeah, yeah. yeah, not bad. Good. Ah, it's all clean down here for a change. We like that. <laughs> Right, now I can sort this tangle up. It's a right mess. Hopefully something will come out when that tide turns, fingers crossed. Have a little charter boat coming out. Right, that's one rig sorted out. I'll put this wishbone away, I'm not going to bother with the wishbone. I've got one rod out left down, one rod out right. Right, both legs are apart. That wasn't too bad. Don't know how the hell they got so close together. Obviously the tides must have brought them together. What a beautiful morning out. It certainly is beautiful. Right, I'm just going to put these rigs away. Just gonna bait up this other rig. I'll put one rig away, I'll just keep three rigs out for now.
the rock pit squid. And the last one, they just go wrap them. But not pretty wrap them in there. Yeah. So I've done. Nice bunch of wrap one. Little bit of squid. And then wrap one tip squid. Nice little mix of baits there for what I've got. I've only got two baits, so. Welcome in, Barry. Gary McNamara, welcome in, buddy. Morning, Shane. You must have a very understanding wife, mate. You're always out fishing. I have to do a number of chores. Nope. <laughs> I was out at five o'clock this morning, so I'll be home by 11 o'clock. I'll cut the grass, do my little chores, mate. I'm on a winner. Uh, Barry, um, I had no target. I've come out um, to do a review on the new rods. Uh, that's why I come out and I had a bit of bait left on the boat. So I grabbed a packet of squid out the freezer. So I thought I'd pop a live out as soon as Paul finished. But yeah, just basically come out to do a rod review, which I've recorded. Um, and if there's any fish that come in now, I will get it on video as well. Bill Coates, welcome in, buddy. That's young Terry on the blue charters. Uh, right, all right, Mel. Good to see you, Bill. But I had a cracking fish first cast this morning as I was doing my intro for people that had just come in. As I was literally, I put both rods out, started talking, and the rod took off. <laughs> and that's all on video. And pin A vlog 14, welcome in. But just waiting for that tide to turn now. Yeah, just don't spam the chat, please, Anne. One, welcome in, one. Well, I can't show you because I'm sat back on the live stream. You'll have to wait for the video. <laughs> but yeah, basically, I've got the new Black Rock Competition Surf. Uh, 1410 and I've got the new Renaissance twin tip.
So yeah, just doing a review on them this morning. I got asked by a tackle shop yesterday to put the carbon tip in the Renaissance. I'm cooking my lunch. But yeah, hopefully when that tide swings, we can pull summer out. That's what I'm hoping, just to get one fish on the live. And there's certainly plenty of bait out. I've been changing them baits quite frequently, so I've got no intent of taking bait home. Was that the early fish this morning on your lucky wishbone rig? No, it won't melt. Nah, I don't use that on the shore, mate. Free hook flapper, just ragweb caught my fish this morning. Malcolm, you know, I'll tell you what it is, Malcolm. It's the fish, don't say nothing, but it's the fish you got off Branksome yesterday afternoon. You, you, you'll know what I'm on about, and it took the rod off, it literally took the rod off. But I'll save it for the video. believe we're not even getting any taps. No taps, nothing. Well, like I say, if you are watching in the background, you're not subscribed, think about subscribing. It really does help my channel. Hit the bell, hit all notifications. And that would be absolutely brilliant. And it don't cost you a single penny. I almost see a grown man cry. I'll tell you what, Malcolm, my heart was going a good and mate when I hooked into it. It was certainly a wake up call first thing in the morning at five o'clock. <laughs> The rod took off, mate, literally took off. Thanks, Diane. Yeah, it took off like a missile melt and it came in like a missile. <laughs> Spur dog, no, not at all Barry. Want a spur dog, you'd have to wait for the video. Obviously if I tell people what I catch when I video, people won't watch the video. <laughs> but that tide should be running back in very soon. All about yeah, it is. Yeah, I got one. I got ones on this morning, milk. But I am going to order some of those hooks, those size two circles. Absolutely dying for a pee, but there's too many people about.
all about the circles. Yeah, it's not so blowy today, Milk. There's a little bit of a, a wind, but not too bad. It's quite nice. Yeah, and can you stop putting symbols in the chat, please? I, I don't allow symbols in the chat. Really sorry, but I'm a fishing channel and I don't want loads of um, symbols. Yeah, appreciate that. Go for a swim. <laughs> But yeah. Angela Burt, welcome in Angela. Hi Shane, everyone. I am going out fishing in half an hour. Tight line, said Angela. I've had over two hours of nothing. <laughs> I'm just waiting for that tide to turn. But it's, it's not going to be a long live this morning. Just a couple of hours. I'm listening while I'm cooking. Fishing. Appreciate that, Anne. But yeah, no symbols in the chat, please, Anne. Obviously, Caroline's probably watching, but yeah, Caroline won't be in the chat. Obviously, we got we had my grandson all night last night and today. Yeah, a few boats starting to head out to Old Abbey now. But what I'll have to do in a minute is that left rod, I'll have to cast it to the right. Cheers, Shane. I'm over in Guernsey, Tuesday, Wednesday. I've been, yeah, getting that mixed tackle. <laughs> have you got no tackle? Sh you must have tackle shop. Oh, it's old and in it. I don't think you've got anything there, have you, Angela? Oh, it's warming up now. It's warming up. That sun's behind the cloud, though. Hey, Simon, welcome in, chat. But if nothing happens, I'll probably stay live to about half past nine if nothing happens. That's a good two, two and a half hour plus live, unless it picks up. Because um, that way I can pack my gear away, ready to leg it back to the car park, so I don't get a fine. But we'll see what happens. The tackle shop closed down. Oh, that's a shame, Angela. There's a lot of tackle shops closing down over here as well.
What a beautiful morning. Someone else go in for a swim. Those rods are quiet, really quiet. Right, let me just check the tide. That's it, use them or lose them. The thing is, the internet's made stuff so cheap and accessible for people now, that's the problem. Yeah, that tide should be on the turn now. Sloth, welcome in, buddy. Morning, oh, Shane. Where do you all your red girls from? From your vi uh, the links in the video in the description, uh, sloth. So if you go back into that lure fishing video, there's a link in the description at the very bottom of where I type it. Oh, here we go. Let's give you a bit of different a uh, different view. We've got the old Brittany ferries going out there. No fish go for a swim. Yeah, I could do. That's the old Brittany ferry going out. She's a big old ship. Look at the size of it. That's a big old vessel. Yeah, have a good day, Mel. Have a good chart this afternoon. Hope you're going to smash it. And a big thanks for, uh, for Friday, Mel. Absolute legend, mate. So relaxing sitting there listening to them waves. <laughs> right, I think that tide's just turning. Like I say, guys, I'll give it about half nine, I reckon, for a live. I just wanted to share a couple of hours with this morning with you lot. And if it's not going to happen, it's not going to happen. So I'll give it a half hour. A great start to my Sunday.
but we'll give it half an hour to flood and then we'll see if we get anything. Yes, right, actually, that does look like somebody stood there. <laughs> somebody guarding my rods. But yeah, this has been really quiet, seriously quiet. I either catch before alive or catch after alive, that's the problem. What's the new rods then, Shane? Right, on the left, I've got the new competition surf on Black Rock, and on the right, I've got the new Renaissance Twin Tip. Um, I, I start reviewing them this morning, so I've got the video. And, I, and that's why I put a live up. I just thought I'd put a couple of hour live up to go with it. Yeah, that's it, Diane. That's the way I see it. Nice couple of hour chill live. I've got a video from this morning which gave me the scene. So, yeah, I'm on a winner, really. Doing a video and doing a live. But yeah, I got sent the new ones on Thursday, Simon. So it's the first time out this morning. Um, I've had a couple of tackle shops ask, ask me to review the new Twin Tip Renaissance. Obviously, I've got the, the first version and I absolutely love them. But now I've got the second generation. And it, it's awesome, mate. For the money, you can't go wrong. I said to Jay, that looks like someone's stat. Yeah, it does. It does, Paul. <laughs> Angela, take care. Massive thanks for coming in and tight lines for today. Have a good session. So I'm here. Yeah, don't worry. Sorting bots. <laughs> what bots have you got? <laughs> Sorting your bots. Just can't believe how quiet it is. It's really quiet. One's that way, that one. I'll tell you, that's what I appreciate is people asking where your line is. Oh, it's a yellow and white chart boat coming out. God, there's loads of people going swimming. <laughs> But like I said, I don't think I'm going to stay much longer, to be honest, it ain't fishing. So I've got the footage I wanted to get this morning. Shared a cut of our live, which is all good. So, yeah, nothing happens by half nine, guys. I'm going to wrap it up, I think. I bet you're tired, Paul. <laughs>
55 in the house and 77 likes for a nice early live. Really appreciate all guys. And like I say, if you are watching in the background and you're not subscribed, think about it, subscribing. It really does help my channel. And it doesn't cost you anything to hit that like. Smash that subscribe. And I will be hitting the beach Friday night if the weather's all good. Get a nice beach session in. Hey, Paul G, how you doing, fella? Yeah, it's been a quiet life, mate. Um, I'll say it again. But yeah, I, I just basically come out to review the two rods I've got, Paul. I got sent them Thursday. So I come out to do like a review video. And I just thought I'd do a couple of hours live after. So I'll be wrapping up about half time, Paul, if nothing happens. I've got, I've got a fair old bit of stuff to do at home, like cut the grass and that, strimmer it and... But appreciate you coming in, Paul. But yeah, it's just been, I've not even had a bite, mate, not a bite. And I, all I've got is squid and rag. Yeah, it is, Paul. I've been here since five o'clock this morning, mate. It's beautiful. It's not even cold. Uh, yeah, beaches are filling up now. So, yeah, I won't be hanging around much longer. Like I say, this is this is like Friday. It just switched off. It's not even switched on, really. I've had one fish out. It's a bit grim up north. <laughs> a little bit ch hey, chilly down here. It's starting to warm up quite nicely. Yeah, that tide's turned. I'm not even getting bites. No bites.
On the ferries just going out. There you go, that's what I go on when I go to Guernsey. The old sea cat. That's what takes you to Guernsey in Jersey. Zoom back out quickly. Hey Gordon, how you doing chat? I've had one fish out before the live Gordon while doing a rod review. <laughs> it's quite good though, because they're two brand new rods, mate. And I caught on the brand new rod, which was brilliant. But yeah, it's been dead quiet. I'm gonna wrap it up at half nine, guys. Let's go back on the chat. How come you don't go out on a bigger one, Shane? That, what do you mean a bigger one, Diane? That, that Condor Ferry is big. Better than me, I blanked, yeah. Well, I blanked for the life. We've not even had a bite. But 10 minutes, guys, I'm gonna wrap it up this morning. But yeah, a massive thank you for the donations, guys. Absolutely awesome. So, Peter Audrin, Diane, and Paul Merritt, thank you very much. And thanks to everybody for joining as well this morning. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, it's too, uh, too slow, Diane. It's a slow ferry. That sea cat, I think, pushes like 40 plus knots. It's very quick. But, I, yeah, I, I don't think I'm going to bother staying out. It's just wasted my time this morning. I've done what I wanted to do, which is, that was the plan. And the live was just a little bonus. But yeah, that's starting to get really warm here. Yeah? <laughs> Might have to take the coat off. Yeah, thanks, Diane. Like I say, I'll leave it to half past nine, guys. You never know. Ten minutes to pull some in, and then I'll stop the live at half past nine. You know me, I, I don't drag lives out. If you're not catching, I don't drag lives out, as you all know. Two, three hour live is perfect if you're not catching. Just to get a chat, catch up and all that sort of stuff. And hopefully, that, uh, old Dano will go live later, hopefully. Right, I'll bake that rig up while I'm sat here.
Yeah, cheers, Alan. You take care, buddy. Have a good day. Right, guys. Right, as my knock on the head. It's not happening this morning. I'll probably give it another 15 minutes and head home. It's, it's, it's just not fishing this morning, really. Just to get one fish out. I've got the con content I wanted this morning and obviously share the live, which is good. Everybody comes in and chats. So we're on a winner. Shane, are you in your usual spot? Has the green put? That's it. Yeah, it has. Yeah. Yeah, you can't actually see the green post. Yeah, the green post is on the front. I don't know why you can't see it. I wonder why you can't see it. The green post. Yeah, it's on top of my um tripod. It's in the middle of my tripod. The triangle bit's right at the top. <laughs> right, take care of everybody. Cheers for the mods. Massive thanks for the donations, guys. Big thanks for watching. It's a nice couple of hour live this morning. Hopefully Danny will go live later. So, yeah, big thanks for coming in, guys. We'll catch you on the next one. Big thanks for the support, as always. Wednesday's video. It's Malcolm's boat. Um, I might have to drop this review video as well. Um, but I'll see how it goes. I've got a busy day, cut the grass, so. But right, take care, guys. Catch you on the next one. See you later, guys. <laughs>